This isn't just a sailing race. Every four years, the world's bravest sailors get together for the ultimate test of human endurance. The Vendée Gulf is a race of legends. You have to have some serious guts and skill to do this race. It's France to France via Antarctica. Three months to complete with a month spent in the Southern Ocean. From tropical to Arctic conditions, storms to dead calm, and they do it all alone. So far, only two Canadians have ever competed in this world-renowned ocean race. The first Canadian, Jerry Roots, tragically lost his life while racing. The second, Derek Hatfield, built his Open 60s Spirit of Canada right here on home soil. The yacht was a symbol of national pride, but about halfway into his race, it was over. Derek Hatfield had to retire early from the Vendée Globe due to a damaged mast. But the end of his race was the beginning of Canada's next Vendée Globe story, and Canadian Ocean Racing was born. The Open 60 is designed to take one man around the world non-stop. It must be 60 feet long, 90 feet tall, and 5 meters deep. The rest is open to innovation, design, and technology. After the Vendée Globe in 2008, we took this beautiful Open 60, built in Canada, and continued to race her for Canada. We took her out in the Pacific Racing Circuit, where she competed and won outside of her class in traditional waters. We wanted to give her a second life she deserved. Now she's on her third life, the one that she was destined for. Lots of volunteers put in many man hours to get her Canada ready for her second journey to the Vendée Globe. We had a round the world race to get to, let alone compete in, and this was just the beginning.